Hi, this is Manny and welcome to the Daily Blitz. Luke chapter 11 verse 13 says this, If you then, who are evil, listen to this, who are evil, know how to give good gifts to your children, how much more, say that with me, how much more will the Heavenly Father give the Holy Spirit to those who ask Him? There are few things that are evidential. There are things that, 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 that just become, you know, the Bible speaks of the gifts, uh, not the gifts, um, it speaks of the fruit of the Spirit. In other words, there's evidence of the Holy Spirit. Some of the things that we have to be convinced about is fruitfulness, joy, peace, blessing apart from the fruit of the Spirit, blessing, contentment of all types and, and shape, uh, all, all, uh, contentment in all different areas in our lives. These things come part and parcel of having the Holy Spirit in your, in your space. And if you are walking with the Holy Spirit, these things must be pre present. If they are not present, it's a time for you, the Bible says, if you do not have, you do not have because you do not ask. So ask so that the Father may make, you, may make your joy complete. And the scripture that we read this morning, Luke 11, 13 says, if evil men, in other words, us who, are, who have corrupt, a corrupted the seed, if we who are flesh are able to give good gifts to our children, how much more will the Father Give the Holy Spirit to those who ask. So my encouragement to you this morning, if those things are absent in your space, joy, contentment, um, um, fruitfulness, blessing, happiness, real joy, if those things are missing in your space, ask the Lord for the Holy Spirit. Because when the Holy Spirit is given to you, the Holy Spirit comes with gifts. The Holy Spirit comes with evidence, with fruit that is in your life. So right now, in the name of Jesus, let me pray with you. Father, I thank you that as every person in faith asks for your Holy Spirit to come upon them or to come into their space, come into their lives, oh God, your word teaches that you, oh God, our good, good Father, will absolutely release the Holy Spirit to us if we ask so that our joy may be complete, so that we may walk in happiness, we may walk in fruitfulness, we may walk in absolute joy like no one can give to us. And I pray, O oh God, that as people do this, they will experience what it is to have the Holy Spirit operating in their lives. In Jesus' name.